Hello and welcome back to another HW Aquascaping video. I hope you're all doing well. Today we're going to look at the Denelay Nano Cube 30 litre, which is home to my uh, shrimp and a few snails. So I have some exciting developments. Uh, number one, if you look just right in the middle of the screen there, little stripy shell, the assassin snails have had babies. And the more exciting news, if you can see it in the middle of the screen, I'll highlight it in a second for you. There we go, we've got our first baby cherry shrimp. I'm really happy about this news, I mean it means that the parameters are doing all well, the shrimp must be happy, um, but yeah I've counted around about 10 so far so really chuffed to bits with that. Um, yeah it's uh, it's just amazing news and I can't wait for them to have more. And there we've got another one just coming into frame, this one's a little bit smaller than the last one so it must mean that it's either from a different batch or yeah, after that it's just uh, the other one's got more food but I'm pretty sure as of the amount of females that I've got in here. I'm pretty sure this is probably from a different batch, um, but uh, but yeah, no. Um, from what I've seen in the tank, there's around about sort of uh, five females that uh, were or have been holding eggs, and um, as of today, I've just seen uh, a couple of them have got more eggs that uh, sort of released them. So, um, really happy about that. Uh, it just means that hopefully we're going to end up with tons of cherry shrimp, which I'm really happy with. You know, like why would you not? Cherry shrimp are great. Um, but I've got some also exciting news that I'll get to in a bit, but let's give them a feed, shall we? So this is what I'm feeding my cherry shrimp and uh, crystal shrimp, as well as the snails that live in here. It's the Vitalis shrimp pellets, uh, so they're an extra small pellet, I'll just take the lid off. It's a bit harder one-handed, but uh, there we go. So as you can see, it's a really soft um, micro pellet, um, really soft food, so like as soon as it hits the water it just sinks more or less straight away. Yeah, it just absorbs water like a sponge, but uh, yeah, the shrimp seem to love it, so uh, I like to give them uh, this on sort of like, not every day, um, I tend to feed really this tank every sort of other day, but it depends really on uh, what I uh, feel, but uh, yeah, let's have a look at the shrimp uh, feeding, we've got our first black crystal coming down, <laughs> look at him, <laughs> he's uh, straight on the feast before anybody else can get into it, but I'll show a bit of a time lapse and uh, you can see the shrimp feeding. There we go. I hope you enjoyed the uh, shrimp feast time lapse there. Um, so the more exciting news that I'll get to now is the crystal black shrimp that's in the centre of the shot here is actually fanning eggs, um, which is really exciting news because um, I'm not lie. When I first brought them over, I did lose quite a few of them. Uh, they just didn't really acclimatise too well. So I've only got about six right now. Um, so hopefully now we can rebuild some population. Um, but I'll keep you updated in future videos. But that's all from me now. Um, if you like this video, give me a like, uh, comment, and I'll try and reply to all of them. And uh, if you're not already, please subscribe, and uh, I'll catch you in the next video. See you later. Bye.